What's up everybody, my name is Tank and welcome back to another video. Today I have for you the new LEGO Fire Command Unit. This is set 60282. It is comprised of 380 pieces and retails for $60. And you, this is everything that you get in the set. You get your tractor trailer pretty much, fire unit, you get four minifigures, Three firefighters, one scientist. You get some new uh, new fire and like a little uh, science lab there. And uh, let's go ahead and get started. As normal, first things first, our four mini figures. Two of them end up actually having names. We have Bob and we have Fedman. Or Feldman. I believe it is Feldman. Uh... It's like the kind of standard fire outfits you normally get. I don't think there's anything too special about them. Just, you know, two unique ones. Scientist, she doesn't really have anything special. Her mug's in the way, but standard scientist outfit. Only thing that is new are these two, Feldman and uh, the guy down here. They have some new fire helmets, which are really, really neat. Black and white caps. So definitely new. I actually, I absolutely uh, love them. So some new unique things to uh, get out there. And uh, Feldman has the remote control for the drone. To drive around and then of course the scientist and Feldman here each have their own secondary faces it's like Feldman likes to sleep a lot on the job and the scientist is uh, scared because her lab is now on fire which we'll get to later but these are your minifigures for the fire command unit so let's go ahead and take a look at the lab a small little lab that you get with this set nothing nothing spectacular about it just a, a container full of hazardous material that is flammable overall you know probably nice little decent build get some play out of it you get the uh, this piece here in the back this red is a little lever that you can press down and the this what they would be dog hair everywhere this little material here uh, falls out and uh, we'll catch everything on fire and of course reset you just go in and lock it back in place here So a very, very simple build. And of course, you know, again, it needs to be on fire. So we get three new flame pieces that actually interlock together. So you can set up, uh, set them up individually or lock them together and you can place it right on top here. And you have a nice target to shoot and extinguish the fire. So that's very, very cool. And of course, uh, these probably aren't going to be cheap once they uh, start selling them individually. These are probably going to be a couple dollars a piece. But that is uh, something very unique because you can also, you, like I said, make a very get a nice tall flame going there. Stack them all up. So uh, some nice new unique pieces, which I love. And then, of course... To extinguish that fire, you need your drone. Simple drone. I don't know if this is new or not. This I haven't uh, seen anything like it lately. It might be maybe in some of the superhero sets, but I'm not sure. But you do have a giant water piece that will eject, and it does. It can get some pretty good distance. 
you uh, got the red button there on the back, angle it up, and fire away. So, so you get some good distance. So you got a nice large drone, again controlled by uh, Feldman. And lastly, we have our truck and trailer. So here is the storage area for your drone. You got your tailgate will drop down and you can easily load and unload the drone. One thing I don't like is there's just, there's a lot of space. So it gets me rolls around a lot, but you know, it's not super, not that big of a deal, but offload and you're ready to go. You have uh, these pieces here, which fold up and down. That way you can take the trailer off and it can freestand. And uh, of course, a simple connection right down here. On the inside here, we have our storage, lots of storage space in here, got a crate, and on the inside you have a fire extinguisher and a megaphone, and then if you want you can shove a bunch of other stuff in there for storage, but here's the trailer, other side opens as well, there's a nice see-through. And then of course, on the top here, you have your pretty much cherry picker arm that will extend. Very odd design, that's for sure. I, I don't like it. I wish they probably used a ladder or maybe done this a different way for design, but I don't particularly like how this is set up because you don't, you don't get a good reach because this pinpoint is back here. I would rather, you know, if it comes off, which it's probably not going to want to. There we go. I probably would have had it like set up a different way. Probably a different way to set it up, but, uh, I just, I don't like it. I probably would have rather have much had the uh, two ladders connected, two or three ladders connected together. And another thing I wish they kind of had was uh, there's no stabilizers anywhere. So normally if you were to have something like this, like a ladder truck or a uh, cherry picker, you'd have some sort of stabilizers that would extend out. And I would have probably, you know, had them hidden, you know, where these fire emblems are here on the side like the like something pulls out from here and extends to stabilize the trailer but that's just me i think that's a slight design thing they probably could have put in and then of course you have your main tractor looks like you know standard semi very aggressive looking smokestacks on either side you got your uh, put your probably walkie-talkie fire axe there or store them in there but otherwise you know very very nice tractor trailer and that is the fire command unit again the only thing is I probably would have done is add stabilizers that extend out on a different uh, system here either a ladder or different setup for the cherry picker but otherwise you know i like the set it does retail for 60 dollars, which i think is pricey but you're getting some new things so uh, what do you guys think about that is 60 dollars fair or is it too much for what you get here let me know in the comments you guys enjoy this video don't forget to hit that like button share it with your friends subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video over and out